Hey guys, have you ever wanted to download any song? Well, uh, here's how to do it. Okay, so what you're gonna have to do is you're gonna type in free YouTube to iPod converter and just click this top link right here. Then it should bring you to this website. First, just it's gonna say to the left, step one, download free YouTube to iPod converter and PSP converter. Just click that. And if you're in Google Chrome, just you can only save it. That's you have to save it or discard it so just save it if you're an internet explorer you can run it or save it you know how to download stuff just download it and whenever it's completely done downloading um uh unpause or well, pause this video when it's done downloading unpause it and yeah so you should be here what you're going to want to do is you want to go to youtube youtube and for this case, I'm just going to be showing you, uh, yes, first song that comes to my head. So, Dynamite. Um, here's the, um, original video, or not the original, but, yeah, I guess the original video, the official video. And you can pause it, it doesn't matter. Just copy the link. We know everyone's looking for Come over here and paste it. And... Um, that's pretty obvious. Now, what you're gonna do is you can either browse wherever you want. You. So, whenever the song is done downloading, this is where it's gonna go. If you want to bring it to a different place, if you want it to go to a different place, just click browse and find it and select where you want it to go. Or you can just open up a new document and, for instance, find out just wherever you want it to go, click the top and copy it and then paste it down here or you can do it by browsing it doesn't really matter but that's how you should know how to do that part um if you want just the song go to mp3 uh audio only and have on insane quality that'll just download the highest possible quality the video has and click download um this should be pretty obvious if you uh know what to do or if you already had a little bit of knowledge with it but for just for this instance I'm just gonna bring it to the music so you can see where it's done downloading and it takes a little while so yeah I told you we wouldn't go to school tomorrow I know we wouldn't go to school tomorrow I never said that. Obviously, we'd go to school tomorrow. Or, obviously, we wouldn't go to school tomorrow. Ah, uh, no school tomorrow. What? Whatever. He sees you. <laughs> Of course, he's gonna attack you whenever you try to talk, attack him. And my ears bleeding. You might need to get me a paper towel. Oh, okay. What? Yeah, I need a paper towel. My ears bleeding. Actually, I don't think it's bleeding anymore, but it was, I swear. I've got blood all over my hand. Well, on my thumb and on the top of these three fingers. No, not really bleeding anymore. Uh, I'll put an annotation in if you're still watching at this point to tell you when this to tell you what minute and whatever to skip to so you can figure out when it's done downloading okay I'll actually put it in before this point I'll put it in like whenever it starts downloading
Anyway, Matthew, I'm making a YouTube video right now. How to use this free YouTube to iPod converter. The one I showed you how to use? Oh, yeah. Yeah. That is legal. What? That is legal. Duh, it's legal. I said illegal. No, it's not illegal unless you get caught, I guess. I don't know. It's not illegal. No, it's just downloading a YouTube video and extracting the audio. That's all it's doing. I did not create this. I am not that skilled. I mean, I can make some programs, but this program, no. Not that good. Like that game I made, I can make that, but yeah, not this. Okay, and then it should come up with this uh, new box saying it's done. Just close out of these. And I told you it, it should go just straight to my music, so let's. And there it is, right there. So if it'll automatically open up iTunes and put it there, or it should. If you have iTunes. But this is already in my iTunes folder, so it's not gonna come up. Um, and here it is. If you wanna change the name of it, right click it, go to properties details and change the title if you change the name of it it's not gonna actually change the name I just changed the file name gotta go to property details title to actually change the name and click OK so yeah that's how you do it yeah Yep, it's over. Oh, darn. Can you try it? Retry.